Ah, oh, guys, look, there's finesse. Look at that finesse. Look. Oh, oh. oh Ty's getting a bit excited with this drill bit. About to get screwing. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh it's a bad thought, actually. Bad image, bad image. <laughs> anyway, um, <clears throat> so we're here with the boat today. Um, the weather's quite gnarly out there today. Um, we were going to take this little baby out off uh, Capri, but we've just checked the windy and it's gone back up again with no uh, no one metre swell. So we're not going to worry about that tomorrow. But we are going to do some modifications on this today and possibly go out for another land-based kitchen cook mission tomorrow. But anyway, what we're going to do is we've got these little things here and Ty will explain what we're sort of going to do. Okay, so um, star ports, railblazer star ports. Yeah. Um, obviously, we've got these all over the kayak so we can have our rod holders, like so. Um, on the yak as well as uh, mounts for cameras and so forth so what we're going to do is we want to rig this boat up so we can get plenty of good footage for you guys so the plan is that we're going to have um, one at this corner mounted there uh, one on the same uh, same sort of spot on the other side just there and we're going to put uh, what else were we doing one on so each side of that. One up there and one on each side yeah, of Yeah, one up here. Up that piece. Yep. Yep. Uh, we need to get one more. For the other side. For the yeah. other side. But, um, but we've got enough yeah. to do one here on both. Oh, one here and one on the other side of the boat. Top of that, yeah. up here. Yep. And yep. at the back there. And we'll put one up here for now. But what we're going to do is get another one. So we can put it on the same side up there. With uh, camera boom. So we're going to have footage like a boom out there back this way boom out there and back towards us so it just helps um because we, we tend to be mucking around a lot with like chest mounts or grabbing it out of a pocket to do it so this way it should make it easier for us to get more awesome footage for you yeah so yeah we'll just mark these out and drill some holes and get to it we'll update you once we get some things mounted <laughs> and don't scratch your nuts because it'll be on camera there's cameras yeah. everywhere <laughs> <laughs> Twice on the boom pole. <laughs> Fucking hell. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> oh, well. <laughs> anyway, so Ty, we've done some, uh, take us through what we've done now, buddy. You take us through it. So we've obviously done uh, what we talked about, our, our um, star port there on this side. And we, as yep. you can see, we've got a boom pole there. Yep. So this camera literally will, will fix to the top of that. And we can swing it all the way around and get different angles of the boat or us fishing. Yeah. And that can go on any of these star ports. So that's the boom pole. So we're going to have one out the back. Yep. On each side and one up the front, so we have three or four poles. So yeah, that's, for cameras. Um, we're gonna have, end up having four cameras on the boat. So yeah, one pole there, and the other um, is it locked? Is it? Yep, put it in there. And then we can have the other there, facing back this way, so you get different angles. Yep, and uh, then we've got these ones here, rod holders set up so we can have the rod facing out that way out towards the front yep and then um, out towards the back you can put rod holders in all these ones if you wanted to put a rod holder here but we've got these here as got well these bait so, board ones here yeah so we'll use the bait board ones a couple of the bait board ones and then uh, these ones on the side here and that'll have us pretty much set really for our fishing and yep. uh, yeah the four spots for uh, boom poles and yeah we've got two rod holders here so um, there's four um, you know, star ports on top of those ones. So we just stuck five on, we need to get one more, so it'll be six. So we can have four cameras and two rod holders on any, any one time moving around the boat. Yep. If, if we're trawling, we could use those ones up here and then take this one out of here and put it out the back on an angle if we wanted to. Um, out that way, it'll make it flatter so the, the rod's way out this corner here, so it spreads out the back and one on the other side doing the same. So we can really spread our rods out across the back if we're trawling. Um, if we're fishing and we're sitting on a spot, um, we like these ones here, but the only problem with them, they're the ones that come with the boat, is when they're straight out the back and you've got three rods in there, they're all too close together. So the idea is we pop this one here on an angle like so, and then we can have our rod facing forward if the current's going this way, and then the ones out the back, um, we can turn it the other way and have it facing out this way if we wanted to. Um, you can put them whatever angle you want, that fit in, you can have them face, facing that way. So then you've got a rod tip out there as well as these ones straight at the back. So it spreads your lines out so we're not getting so many tangles. So that's the modification done to the little finesse. Yep. Um, like I said, we're going to give them a go tomorrow, but um, the way the weather is, we'll check again at 6 o'clock tonight. It usually changes about 4. They do an update. Um, we'll make a plan, but um, at this stage, if it stays the way it is, 
then basically um, it will be a no go in the boat with one and a half meter swells. We're not we're not that keen. Um, but it might be another um, land based mission down uh, Kapiti Ways, uh, o o Otaki Way. So we might go to the beach down there and use the old cannon and blast out into the holes out there. So. Yep. We'll see what happens time, we'll come up with a plan tonight, but yeah, um, yeah, modifications on little finesse is done and she's a beautiful little boat and uh, yeah, keep your eyes open in a year's time what we do with this thing, so um, got a bit more modifications, a bit more upgrades to do on it, but um, yeah, got some big plans for the future, cheers.